Hi, second graders. We're going to work on our next lesson in our geography book. Uh, today you're going to need your geography workbook. You'll need a pencil. And if you're going to add some color to it, you'll need either colored pencils or crayons. If you're going to use markers, put something in between the papers so that they don't bleed through. But I prefer using colored pencils because they're easier to color with on these workbooks with a thin paper. Okay? So we're going to open up to this map. Looks like it's a map of a school and it's got a playground. Cafeteria is labeled over here. Baseball diamond up at the top. Soccer field. And then it's got something that a lot of maps have. Do you remember what this is called? It's called a compass rose. And what does a compass rose tell us? Does it tell us which direction we need to go to get to different places, right? So if I'm standing right here with these friends and I need to go to the playground, I need to walk to the left. Although when I'm walking that way, I'm not facing left. I'm not walking, going side to side, right? To me, it's just forward. So for somebody to tell me, go left, that isn't necessarily the direction I'm looking. But if they tell me to go west, west is always going to point me in that direction. So then I know I need to go west, okay? If I need to go to school because classes are starting, they can't tell me, well, walk down. I'm standing in the middle of a park. Walking down doesn't make sense. I don't need to go down. I need to go south, right? If I need to go up to my sports practice, I need to go up. Nope, not up. <laughs> Only on paper it looks like I'm going up. I need to go north. Okay, so the directions are going to be very helpful for us when we're telling people where to go. Okay, so we need to answer some questions. This map shows a city, park, or school. Circle which one you think. City, park, or school. Circle the places where games are played. Are games played at a baseball diamond, in the cafeteria, at a parking lot, and we've got soccer field. Hint, there might be more than one answer. Baseball diamond, cafeteria, parking lot, soccer field. Okay, we gotta fill in a blank here. The blank shows four directions. What is that thing called that shows N, S, E, W, never eat soggy waffles, north, east, south, west. That is called a compass rose. Which direction does N stand for? North. Okay, take a second and get those filled in. If you ever need to pause the video while you're filling in answers, feel free to do that. On the compass rose, which direction is pointing down? That's going to be the S. Which direction is that? South. And what does the E and the W stand for? Never eat soggy waffles. Eating waffles? East and West. Okay, get those filled in. Then head over to the next page. Find the baseball diamond. It is blank of the cafeteria. Okay, so we need to figure out where the cafeteria is, where the baseball diamond is. Starting at the cafeteria, which way would we need to go to get to the baseball diamond? Okay, 
Okay, if I'm at the cafeteria, which way do I need to go to get the baseball diamond? My finger's moving up. So which way is that on the compass rose? North. Okay, the soccer field is blank of the baseball diamond. So if I'm starting at the baseball diamond, I'm standing there playing baseball, but I want to go to play soccer, which direction do I need to go? Not the baseball diamond. I'm done playing baseball. I need to go play soccer. I'm going left on the paper, which means that I'm going west. The playground is blank of the parking lot. Okay, so if I'm standing in the parking lot and I'm asking somebody, how do I get to the playground? Which way are they going to tell me to go? I guess I'm here. This is me. And I want to go to the playground. I'm going to go up, which means I'm going to go north. N-O-R-T-H. What is closest to the school building? Is that the baseball diamond, the playground, or the parking lot? So if I'm at the school building, is it the parking lot, the playground, what else did they say, or the baseball diamond? The parking lot is the closest. Okay, here's your challenge. Do you think the playground is in a good location? Write about where you think the playground should be. Write your answer on the back of the map. Well, there's not room on the back of the map, so here's your options. Decide if the playground is in a good location. There's the playground. Or would you move it, if you were designing this map, would you move it somewhere else? You can either write down your answer down here, or you can record it for me when you upload your pictures into Seesaw. Tell me where you would move it and why you would move it there. Okay, I look forward to seeing your answers. See you guys later.